the guy that I want to talk about, Lamar Jackson. Do it. As salty as ever, he gets up and he's walking. As he is adjusting his hat, he starts shaking his head. And you know he's shaking his head because you talk about guys that pass him up, teams that pass him up. He's thinking to himself, he's thinking to himself, I can't believe that these guys Look over what I've done, what I brought to the table as a college quarterback, the ability to throw the ball, to run the ball, successfully being one of the best rushing quarterbacks they've seen in college history. And still, you guys pick all of these quarterbacks before me. I can appreciate the fact that he's coming in and he said, I'm going to bring a Super Bowl. He's not going to play right now. Joe Flacco is the quarterback for the Ravens, but he's going to sit back. He's going to relax. Mm -hmm. He's going to get hungry. Real talk, mm -hmm. real question for you, because everyone's going to celebrate he got drafted in the first round. Yeah. If he had run the 40 at his pro day, if he had mm -hmm. run the 40 at his combine. Didn't matter. It doesn't, he would go in 32 regardless? If he hired an agent. Deion if he hired an agent, because we, we, we cheered it on the whole time through the process that do your own way, do your own way, and he fell. Why, why would it have mattered? We know that he's the fastest quarterback out of mm -hmm. everybody. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter if he would have ran the 40 or not, if he's going to go get an agent or not. I feel like... Teams had their mind made up. And we talked about this the whole time. And I said, you guys are being so dramatic about who loves what quarterback. Every team has their mind made up on who they fall in love with. Lamar Jackson fell. Mm -hmm. And it is what it is at this point. But I'll say this. And I'm not comparing him to Cam Newton. I don't want people to light me up on Twitter. Cam Newton's number one pick. Cam had that season a couple years ago where he had 40-plus passing TDs and 10 rushing to tell. Mm -hmm. When he has the ball in his hand and the pocket breaks down, Cam is as electric as LeBron James on a fast mm -hmm. break. You remember when Deshaun Watson got the ball last year yeah. and the pocket broke down and he started escaping the pocket and we said, oh my goodness, this is as good as it gets. Lamar Jackson is that type of talent. The benefit he has, he gets to sit back and watch a quarterback that has a Super Bowl ring. Different skills. That has a different skill yeah. set that is a pocket quarterback. He adds that element just like his head coach said. Yeah. Lamar Jackson has a chance to develop. If he develops as one of the best passers with that athletic ability, it's, it's it could be one of the best young quarterbacks in this league. Peter, you've talked about it. He broke the template of what you're supposed to do. He did it his way. And here's the thing. Would it have gone differently? I think he won in the end. Maybe he goes, what, he goes eight or nine slots earlier? If yeah. he runs a 40, if he hires an agent? He went in the first round without doing anything he was told to do. It worked. I think Lamar Jackson gets the last lap. He's a first-round pick doing it his way. Yep. So I respect it. Mm -hmm.